Listen closely, child, for there is something you need to know. Someone from your past is willing to give up everything to find you, to rekindle a connection that once existed. This journey they are taking is filled with longing, with a determination that you may not fully understand. But I am asking you to be careful with your choices. Not every path from the past is meant to be walked again, and not every door needs to be reopened. There are reasons why certain people drift away, why some connections fade over time. I am the one who leads relationships, who guides each person in and out of your life. This person from your past may come with intentions that seem sincere, but I want you to weigh everything carefully. Reflect on who you are now, the growth and healing that have taken place. Not all that glitters is gold, and I am calling you to wisdom. When this person reappears, remember that you are no longer who you once were. You have walked through fires, overcome challenges, and become stronger. The choices you make now must honor the path you are on, the person you are becoming. They may promise things, offer parts of themselves, but I want you to hold fast to who you are today. Do not let nostalgia blur your vision, for I have guided you to a new season. There is love in every chapter, even in those that are closed. This person from your past may be seeking something they lost, a piece of their own story that they left behind with you. But I am the one who heals hearts, who brings closure where there is pain. If they come with open hands, willing to give all, consider carefully what that means. Sometimes, letting go is the truest form of love, even if it's difficult. I know the whispers that may stir in your heart when they return. Memories may rise, emotions may stir, but I am with you in each of these moments. Do not let emotion alone guide you, for true wisdom comes from listening deeply, discerning what is of me and what is only of the past. Trust that I am here, that I will provide clarity as you weigh each choice. Take your time, child, for haste is not your friend in this decision. Now, pause with me. If you feel my guidance with you, steadying your heart, write 349. This number is your sign of trust, a reminder that you are not alone in this journey and that I am with you in every decision. The past holds many memories, but it is the future I am preparing for you. I have shaped each step you have taken, led you through trials and growth. This person from your past may come with a genuine heart, but I want you to see with clear eyes. Ask yourself if their journey aligns with yours, if their return is part of the path I am leading you on. Not every offer, even one that is sincere, is part of the destiny I have crafted for you. Consider carefully what you are willing to give in return. Sometimes, people from the past bring with them old patterns, familiar but unhelpful ways of being. I am the God who transforms, who renews, and who leads you to a life of abundance. If this person's return does not contribute to the life I am building in you, then wisdom is to walk forward with grace, but to walk forward nonetheless. Trust that I am guiding you, that I know the full picture. When old emotions arise, remember that feelings are part of your journey, but they are not your compass. I am your guide, the one who knows your heart, your desires, and your needs. Feelings may stir memories, but it is my presence within you that brings true understanding. Let me be the source of your decisions, the clarity in your spirit as you navigate this. I will not lead you astray. Remember, too, that true love does not require sacrifice that leads to harm or loss of self. If this person is willing to give up everything, ask yourself what they hope to gain. Relationships are partnerships, not transactions. I desire wholeness for you, a union that enriches rather than depletes. Be cautious of those who are willing to sacrifice everything without thought, for it may come from a place of need rather than genuine love. There is a reason you are in the season you are in, a purpose to the place I have brought you. 
this person may seek to re-enter your life, but not everyone from your past is meant to join you in your future. Seek me in this decision, for I am here to offer guidance, to show you the path that aligns with the calling I have placed within you. I will give you peace where there is clarity, and I will hold you steady if confusion arises. Pause again, child. If you feel the strength of my wisdom guiding you, write 812. This number is your affirmation of faith, a sign that you trust my voice above all else, and that you seek my guidance in every choice. This person may come with promises, with words that tug at your heart, but remember that true love is steadfast and does not waver with time. I am the God who brings people together in truth, who binds hearts in a way that is enduring. Be careful with your choices, for the decisions you make now will shape the future I am preparing for you. Let me be your anchor, your foundation, the one who guides you into the fullness of life. It is possible that this person is seeking healing, that they see something in you that reminds them of peace. But I am the healer of all hearts, and not every burden is yours to carry. Sometimes, people need to walk their own path to find their own way to me. Do not feel that you must be the one to bring healing to their soul, that is my work, and I am faithful in it. Your choices should honor the path you are called to, the peace I have given you. As you weigh this decision, keep your heart open to my voice. I am here, offering you wisdom, guiding you toward what is true and good. Do not let the past dictate your choices, for I am a God of new beginnings, of fresh starts. There is beauty in what was, but there is also beauty in what is to come. Trust that I am leading you toward a future filled with hope and purpose, one that honors the person you have become. There may be moments when nostalgia clouds your vision, when memories seem to pull you back. But I am the one who brings clarity, who helps you see with eyes of truth. Ask yourself if this person's presence enriches the journey I have set before you, or if it distracts from it. This is a time for discernment, a time to listen deeply to the still, small voice within. I am here, providing the clarity you need. Let this decision be one made with peace, not haste. I am guiding you toward a choice that reflects who you are today, not who you once were. Your growth, your healing, your journey with me are sacred. Honor this by choosing with wisdom, by trusting that I will show you the way. When you feel peace, when my guidance resonates within you, you will know that you are on the right path. Pause once more with me. If you feel my peace within you, a sign that you are willing to trust in my guidance, write 503. This number is a reminder that you are choosing wisely that my peace is your guide in all things. This person from your past may have changed, but I am the one who knows hearts fully. Trust me to reveal what is true, to show you the authenticity of their intentions. Do not feel obligated to make a quick decision, take time, for wisdom grows in patience. I am with you, every step of the way, offering the discernment you need to choose with clarity and grace. Remember, child, that your life is a precious gift, a journey that I am unfolding with care. I have woven each thread, placed each person with intention, and led you to this place for a reason. Let me be the one who shows you which paths to take, which doors to open, and which to close. I am your guide, your protector, the one who desires only the best for you. Be mindful of choices that feel urgent, for urgency is rarely of me. My guidance comes with peace, with clarity, with a sense of knowing. If this person's return fills you with confusion or doubt, bring it to me. I will help you discern what is true, what aligns with the future I am preparing. Let your choices be grounded in my wisdom, for I am the one who sees all things clearly. Not every relationship is meant to be rekindled and not every connection from the past is aligned with your present. This person's willingness to sacrifice is not necessarily a sign of love, 
sometimes it reflects a need they feel within themselves. I am the source of fulfillment, the one who completes every heart. Let me be the guide in this decision, for I will show you the truth of their intentions. I am here to protect you, to guard your heart as you navigate this path. You are precious to me, and I will not let you fall. When you feel unsure, when choices feel heavy, remember that I am your refuge. I will provide the clarity you need, the wisdom to choose well. Let this decision honor the growth I have placed within you, the strength that has come through walking with me. Now, pause with me. If you feel the strength of my love guiding you, and your willingness to follow my lead, write 296. This number is a sign of your commitment to walk in my wisdom, a reflection of your trust in the journey we are on together. Every choice shapes the journey ahead, and I am here to guide each one with care. This person's return may hold meaning, but let me show you what that meaning truly is. It may be a chance for healing, for closure, or simply a moment to remember the journey you have walked. Trust that I am leading you toward what is best, that my wisdom will illuminate the path you are meant to take. You are stronger than you realize, filled with resilience, and I am the one who has built that strength within you. This decision is not a burden but an opportunity to honor the growth that has taken place. Choose in a way that reflects who you are now, not who you once were. Let my peace be your guide, for I am here, offering clarity and wisdom for each step. When you feel moments of doubt, remember that I am the source of all understanding. Bring your questions to me, your uncertainties, your fears. I am the one who brings light to confusion, who shows you the way forward with grace. Trust that my love for you is unwavering, that my guidance is here to protect you. This decision is a part of your journey, a chance to walk in my truth. Allow yourself to feel my peace, for it is within this peace that true wisdom grows. When you are rooted in me, in the stillness of my presence, the right choices become clear. Let my peace be the assurance you seek, the anchor that holds you steady. I am with you, beloved, guiding you through each choice, leading you toward the life I have prepared. Take a final pause with me now. If you feel the depth of my peace guiding you, and your trust in my wisdom, write 721. This number is your affirmation, a sign that you are walking in faith, choosing with clarity, and trusting in the journey I am leading you on. You are standing at a crossroads, child, a place where past and present meet. This person from your past carries memories, emotions, and the way of days gone by. They are seeking something they feel they lost, but I am here to remind you that your journey has led you beyond that past. Your heart has been shaped by growth, healing, and a deepening of your relationship with me. Be careful, for choices made now can affect the path forward that I have prepared for you. This journey isn't just about reconnecting with someone familiar, it's about staying aligned with the purpose I have set for you. This person may come with an open heart, but it is my will and my timing that bring true peace and fulfillment. Let me be the foundation of your decision. Look to me, and I will show you what aligns with the future I envision for you, a future crafted with love, wisdom, and purpose. Remember that some connections from the past hold a piece of who you once were, but not necessarily of who you are becoming. You have grown in strength, in resilience, and in clarity. You are not the same person who first walked that path, and this journey you're on is sacred. Guard it well, for I am building something within you that deserves respect and protection. Let your choices honor the life you are living now, a life full of promise and possibility. There may be parts of you that long for familiarity, for the comfort of past connections. That's natural, child, but I am the God of new beginnings, of fresh starts, of futures filled with hope. Nostalgia may call to you, but I am asking you to trust in the path forward, to hold on to the future I am leading you toward. 
This is a chance to see how far you have come, to celebrate the person you are becoming through every step of faith and every moment of growth. As this person seeks to re-enter your life, remember the importance of boundaries, of keeping your heart aligned with my will. I am the one who fills every need, who brings healing to every wound, and who leads you into wholeness. Trust that I am guiding you, that I am the source of the love and connection you seek. This moment is an invitation to walk with wisdom, to let your choices reflect the growth and clarity you have gained. Pause with me here, child. If you feel the strength of my presence guiding you in this decision, write 452. This number is a reminder of your commitment to walk in my wisdom, a sign that you are choosing to trust in the journey I am leading you on. The past has its place, but it is in the future that I am calling you to walk. Each step forward is a movement toward the destiny I have prepared. This person may hold a piece of who you were, but you are no longer bound by what once was. I am asking you to be cautious, to weigh each choice carefully, for I know the life that awaits you. Choose in a way that honors the path we are on together, the journey that has led you to a place of greater understanding. When emotions feel strong, remember that I am the one who brings peace, the one who settles your spirit with clarity. Do not be swayed by fleeting feelings or words that stir old memories. I am offering you the chance to see with new eyes, to choose from a place of strength and wisdom. By turning to me, you allow my peace to be the anchor in every decision, guiding you through any confusion or doubt. Let love be your guide, but let it be the kind of love that respects boundaries, that cherishes the journey you are on. I am teaching you to love yourself as I love you, to honor the growth and healing that have taken place within you. Sometimes, true love means letting go, allowing others to find their own path to me. Do not feel guilt or fear in setting boundaries, trust that I am guiding you toward a love that is balanced and healthy. There is a power in choosing with intention, in making decisions that align with who you are today. This person may come with all they have to give, but I want you to consider what you are willing to receive. Not every sacrifice is a reflection of true love, and not every gesture is a sign of commitment. Seek the kind of love that is rooted in mutual respect, that grows with patience, and that aligns with my purpose for your life. When you seek me first, I will reveal what is true, what is good, and what is meant for your future. I know the desires of your heart, the dreams and hopes that fill your spirit. Let me be the one who guides you in this decision, who helps you see the truth with clarity. I am here, offering wisdom, strength and peace as you walk forward. Trust that my plans for you are filled with hope, that my guidance will lead you into a life of joy and fulfillment. Pause with me again, child. If you feel my peace guiding your choices, write 713. This number is a sign of your dedication to my wisdom, a reminder that you are walking in faith and trust, anchored by my presence. This decision is part of a larger journey, a step toward the future I have prepared for you. Let every choice you make reflect the growth and healing that have taken place. You are no longer bound by the past, for I am the one who has freed you, who has led you into a new season. Trust that I am guiding you toward what is best, that each decision you make now will open doors to greater peace and understanding. When memories stir, let them remind you of the lessons you have learned, of the strength you have gained. I have been with you through every moment, every struggle, every triumph. This person's willingness to return may be genuine, but remember that it is my guidance that will reveal what is right. I am the source of all wisdom, the one who brings clarity to the heart. Trust that I will show you the way. You have been given the gift of discernment, a sensitivity to my spirit that allows you to see beyond appearances. Use this gift as you navigate the choices before you. Let your heart be anchored in my truth, in the wisdom I am offering you. By seeking me, you are choosing a path that honors both your past and your future. 
This is your journey, a sacred journey that I am leading with love and purpose. The relationships in your life are gifts, but not all are meant to last forever. Some are here to teach you, to shape you, to help you grow. Trust that I am the one who arranges every connection, who knows the role each person plays. By allowing me to guide your choices, you are honoring the life I am building within you. Let me lead you, child, for I know the desires of your heart. In moments of uncertainty, remember that I am with you. You are not alone in this decision, for my presence surrounds you. When you feel confused or unsure, turn to me. I will give you the clarity you seek, the peace that surpasses understanding. This journey is one of faith, of trusting that my love for you is steadfast and unchanging. I am the God who guides, who protects, who leads you into all truth. Let's pause together one final time. If you feel the depth of my love guiding you, write 540. This number is your affirmation of trust, a symbol of your commitment to walking in my wisdom and love. You are on a journey filled with purpose, each step guided by my hand. This decision, though it may seem complex, is an opportunity to trust in the growth that has taken place. You are walking forward, child, into a life that reflects the beauty and strength I have placed within you. Every choice you make now is shaping the future I am preparing, a future of joy, peace, and fulfillment. This person's return is only a part of the story, a chance to see how far you have come. Let me show you the way forward, for I am the author of your journey. There is no need to rush or fear, for I am with you, offering guidance with each step. Trust in the work I am doing within you, for I am leading you into a life that honors the fullness of who you are becoming. Be patient with yourself, for this decision is significant, but I am here, giving you the strength and wisdom you need. Let my peace be your compass, my voice your guide. In every choice, seek the path that reflects your growth, your healing, your relationship with me. I am the source of all truth, and I will not lead you astray. Walk forward with confidence, knowing that my love surrounds you. This moment, this decision, is a part of a greater plan, a journey that I am unfolding with care. By trusting in my guidance, you are choosing a path filled with hope, with love, with a future that honors who you are. Let each choice reflect the light I have placed within you, the wisdom that has grown through every step of faith. You are cherished, beloved, and I am with you always. Finally, if you feel my presence guiding you into this future, write 168. This number is your sign of faith, a testament to the journey we are on together, a reminder that every choice made in my wisdom leads to a life filled with peace and purpose. Listen closely, child, for there is something you need to know. Someone from your past is willing to give up everything to find you, to rekindle a connection that once existed. This journey they are taking is filled with longing, with a determination that you may not fully understand. But I am asking you to be careful with your choices. Not every path from the past is meant to be walked again, and not every door needs to be reopened. There are reasons why certain people drift away, why some connections fade over time. I am the one who moves relationships, who guides each person in and out of your life. This person from your past may come with intentions that seem sincere, but I want you to weigh everything carefully. Reflect on who you are now, the growth and healing that have taken place. Not all that glitters is gold, and I am calling you to wisdom. When this person reappears, remember that you are no longer who you once were. You have walked through fires, overcome challenges, and become stronger. The choices you make now must honor the path you are on, the person you are becoming. They may promise things, offer parts of themselves, but I want you to hold fast to who you are today. Do not let nostalgia blur your vision, for I have guided you to a new season. 
There is love in every chapter, even in those that are closed. This person from your past may be seeking something they lost, a piece of their own story that they left behind with you. But I am the one who heals hearts, who brings closure where there is pain. If they come with open hands, willing to give all, consider carefully what that means. Sometimes, letting go is the truest form of love, even if it's difficult. I know the whispers that may stir in your heart when they return. Memories may rise, emotions may stir, but I am with you in each of these moments. Do not let emotion alone guide you, for true wisdom comes from listening deeply, discerning what is of me and what is only of the past. Trust that I am here, that I will provide clarity as you weigh each choice. Take your time, child, for haste is not your friend in this decision. Now, pause with me. If you feel my guidance with you, steadying your heart, write 349. This number is your sign of trust, a reminder that you are not alone in this journey and that I am with you in every decision. The past holds many memories, but it is the future I am preparing for you. I have shaped each step you have taken, led you through trials and growth. This person from your past may come with a genuine heart but I want you to see with clear eyes. Ask yourself if their journey aligns with yours, if their return is part of the path I am leading you on. Not every offer, even one that is sincere, is part of the destiny I have crafted for you. Consider carefully what you are willing to give in return. Sometimes, people from the past bring with them old patterns, familiar but unhelpful ways of being. I am the God who transforms, who renews, and who leads you to a life of abundance. If this person's return does not contribute to the life I am building in you, then wisdom is to walk forward with grace, but to walk forward nonetheless. Trust that I am guiding you, that I know the full picture. When old emotions arise, remember that feelings are part of your journey, but they are not your compass. I am your guide. The one who knows your heart, your desires, and your needs. Feelings may stir memories, but it is my presence within you that brings true understanding. Let me be the source of your decisions, the clarity in your spirit as you navigate this. I will not lead you astray. Remember, too, that true love does not require sacrifice that leads to harm or loss of self. If this person is willing to give up everything, ask yourself what they hope to gain. Relationships are partnerships, not transactions. I desire wholeness for you, a union that enriches rather than depletes. Be cautious of those who are willing to sacrifice everything without thought, for it may come from a place of need rather than genuine love. There is a reason you are in the season you are in, a purpose to the place I have brought you. This person may seek to re-enter your life, but not everyone from your past is meant to join you in your future. Seek me in this decision, for I am here to offer guidance, to show you the path that aligns with the calling I have placed within you. I will give you peace where there is clarity, and I will hold you steady if confusion arises. Pause again, child. If you feel the strength of my wisdom guiding you, write 812. This number is your affirmation of faith, a sign that you trust my voice above all else and that you seek my guidance in every choice. This person may come with promises, with words that tug at your heart, but remember that true love is steadfast and does not waver with time. I am the God who brings people together in truth, who binds hearts in a way that is enduring. Be careful with your choices, for the decisions you make now will shape the future I am preparing for you. Let me be your anchor, your foundation, the one who guides you into the fullness of life. It is possible that this person is seeking healing, that they see something in you that reminds them of peace. But I am the healer of all hearts, and not every burden is yours to carry. Sometimes, people need to walk their own path, to find their own way to me. Do not feel that you must be the one to bring healing to their soul, 
That is my work, and I am faithful in it. Your choices should honor the path you are called to, the peace I have given you. As you weigh this decision, keep your heart open to my voice. I am here, offering you wisdom, guiding you toward what is true and good. Do not let the past dictate your choices, for I am a God of new beginnings, of fresh starts.